hey guys what's up and welcome back to it's about everything so in today's episode i'm going to show you how you can properly join two high ampere electrical wires together so the traditional way of uh, joining cable is just by putting it together and twisting it but that's not the appropriate way of doing it because the wires will eventually heat up and they can't uh, they cannot carry the rated amperage of the cable so the best way to do it is strip both the wires to about an inch and then take two or three strands of the wire and then wrap it around the base of the stripped wire like so and keep on doing it until about a quarter of the total length of the wire is covered now repeat the process with the other wire as well and after you are done, you can see the wire is wrapped in the base and after that the remaining wire you can split them into equal groups like so, so that they form the English letter Y. Repeat the same process with both the wires. After that bring them face to face and turn one wire 90 degree compared to the other one and match them with each other like so. And now twist the wires and remember to twist the wires in the same direction as you have uh, twisted the strands of wire in the base of the wire in this way you will not unwrap the wires that you previously wrapped in the base for added strength use a plier if the wire gauge is much thicker than use a plier and don't use a plier which has teeth use the smooth section of the nose needle nose plier and turn it and there you go the wire is completely joined and it's hard you cannot pull it apart and it will take the rated amperage of current that the wire is manufactured and it won't heat up so the next thing next type of joint is a t-joint where you need to tap into an existing wire to get a connection so the process is same Take few strands of the wire and wrap it around the base of the wire like so and wrap it to about quarter of the total length of the wire remaining three quarters that we will use later now take the black wire and strip to about three quarters of the length that we left in the previous wire and split the wires in equal groups after that do the same with the blue wire strip the wires in two equal groups so that they form an English letter why now put one group of the wire through the black wire like so and then close the two groups in the black wire now twist the open ends of the blue wire like so you can use a plier to do that remember not to use a plier which has teeth now this type of joint will not compromise the current carrying capability of the black wire and it will 
also not heat up you can also use the same type of joint in much more thicker wires and the current carrying capability of the blue wire will also not be compromised the wires will take the rated amperage that we are meant to if you want to tighten the wire make sure to use the flat surface of the needle nose plier which does not have any teeth and there you can see the wires are nicely joined and it will take the current that they are rated for So this was it guys I hope you liked this video and I was able to give you available information about joining cables so if you like this video then hit the like button and share it with your friends and if you are new in my channel then please consider subscribing my channel so I'll see you in my next video have a nice day